We only got one chance and got one life to live And it's do or die, gotta make it count So lose your worries, let your problems go on Until my whole body burns out, I ain't never gonna slow down Okay, now what about this one? What color is this one gonna be? Red. Red. Mom. Uh huh. Do we gotta do all the colors? You gotta do all these apples. All the little ones, the little A's get colored red, and all the big A's get colored green. Floyd and Rolly need your help to knock down an old building. Let's get to work removing bricks. For this job, you'll need to find numbers. Ready? Find the number eight. What's the number eight, Mom? Which one do you think it is? That one? Yes. <laughs> it's not that screen. You gotta move the mouse. And then you gotta click it. <gasps> find the number one. Well, what's the number one? You gotta move, you, baby, that's a seven. And it's not a touch screen. <laughs> I know. Find the number 10. Which one's number 10? No. Yeah. Find the number zero. Okay. Zero. Number three. You do it, Mom. No. Mm. Find the number seven. Oh no! What'd you do? You knocked the whole building down. Hey guys, so today I will be making some buffet beans. I mentioned them yesterday in the video. Um, I went to, I'm gonna go ahead and make them in the crock pot and then I will just do my ham in the oven so that's what I decided so I'm gonna have buffet beans I'll probably have green beans for the girls as well and mashed potatoes and then we'll have ham excuse my dryer but anyway these are the ingredients I'm using so I've got a can of pork and beans it doesn't matter the brand um, llama beans or if you don't like llama beans add whatever beans you want um, my husband has a bunch of these seasoned butter beans so I'm gonna go ahead and add that in there too um, and then a can of kidney beans you're gonna need some brown sugar some yep I'm gonna need a bell pepper and a small onion and some bacon so I'm um, oh and some mustard so ground mustard so these are the ingredients I will be putting in my beans I'm gonna go ahead and get my crock pot out and dice these guys up here I'm gonna go ahead and start dumping my beans I'm going to add one can of lima beans you want the liquid so you just dump the entire can your butter beans if you choose to add them and I will be adding them with the liquid you're going to add your kidney beans with the liquid 
and you will add your pork and beans whatever flavor it don't have to be great value it can be whatever flavor you want it to be whatever flavor I meant to say whatever brand okay I'm just gonna mix these up a little bit here then you're gonna add go ahead and add my green pepper I used a small green pepper and a small onion Okay, now I'm going to add about four or five strips of bacon. I'm going to go ahead and open this up and cut them up. Okay, we've got our bacon. We need a tablespoon of Worcestershire. Somebody told me to call it, um, what did they say? Rooster. Rooster of the rooster sauce. I heard people call it dub sauce. I've heard it called lots of stuff. So I'm just gonna add one tablespoon. But if you are like my family and they love this stuff, I'm gonna add two tablespoons just because I'm feeling a little extra, extra roosty. And then I'm going to add um. About a half a teaspoon, I think, of this dry mustard. Let me find my half teaspoon here. That's a quarter. So I'm gonna add a half teaspoon of dry mustard. I'm just gonna sprinkle that around. And then I need a half cup of brown sugar. I'm just going to eyeball it because I don't want to dirty up another, another thing. Where did my spoon go? I had a spoon. Y'all know where I put it? I probably put it in the sink. Darn me. No, I put it in the can. Woo -hoo -hoo. Okay. Let me rinse this out. Dip it in there with it. Okay, so about a half a cup of brown sh sugar. A little more. And that is all. You will need some cheese. I forgot to add that into the beginning that you will need some cheese, but that's for the end. So go ahead and give it a good mix. And I'm going to cook this on high for about, well, it'll probably be about four hours. So, by the time every we eat dinner at 6 o'clock tonight, this will be done because it's 2 o'clock right now. So, Did you? I used a paper plate to get all the spider webs. Ew, spider webs. Ronnie, where you going, bud? They come in to say hello. They're molting, you guys. So many feathers. They're just everywhere. Are y'all molting? Somebody told me my hens look rough. But that's just because we had eight, six, seven. Yeah, we had no. We had nine. We had nine roosters. But we got rid of. Don't let him out. Don't let him out. I'm going in here. Okay. You shut the door. I'm yeah. Not no, shut the door. We had nine roosters in the early spring. And into the early summer. 
so. Are you going to know the chickens in there? I pulled this cage out. So this cage used to be under here. We had way too many um, hens and roosters, so there really wasn't enough room. They have this pole, and they have this pole, and then they have, they like to roost up here, and there is one, two, what? Nobody peck my toes. We got some broody hens. These guys are always broody. One, two, three. I don't know, I think we had four. But we got three roosting poles in here. So anyway, this. I'm going to chicken hop in here and then I can close No, we're not going to close the door. So this used to be under there. And they used to use it as a roost. she can walk in there. Okay, well, hold on. So anyway, it got loaded with poop and everything. So I couldn't, like you couldn't budge it. It was just cemented. So I went ahead and pulled it out. And now I plan on, yeah, I can move it. Moving it out of here fully now that all the poop is off. I pulled my pants up to, to make it as an underwear. You do, here. Yeah, like on my belly button. Actually, I think I'm actually gonna leave it in here. No, Journey, don't don't lock them in there. They won't be able to get out. Um, what happened? Show me, boo -boo. Let's see if I can see it. Oh, let's see the other boo boo. Oh my goodness. Knees are the same way. You want to tell what, what happened? Oh. oh my goodness. We had an accident in the chicken coop. What happened? Oh, did Willie get you? And Jessica? Uh -huh. I think Willie came at her. And so she freaked out and tried to run away. And when she tried to run, she slipped on the hay. And then she wiped out and hit her elbows and her knees on those cement blocks. And you're my poor baby. I'm so sorry. <laughs> what is up with that lip hanging out? You see that? <laughs> Go wash your hands. Yes. Yes, because you were out there. We washed, changed her clothes, cleaned her boo-boos, disinfected them with peroxide, and then we put some Neosporin on them. So, But she didn't wash her hands yet. She's been rubbing her face. She didn't actually touch anything. Well, she hit the ground, so... I guess she did touch something. It was the ground. <sighs> anyway, I have to go to work. It is 2.37 right now. I called my husband to let him know I was going to do these beans and then the ham and mashed potatoes. So, i got to figure out how many pounds my ham is. It's not a big ham. It's just a little spiral ham. And... I mean, I'm thinking at most, I don't know, it probably needs to warm maybe an hour, hour and a half at most. I think it's like 15 minutes per Alexa notification. One new notification from Amazon shopping based on your order history. It may be time to reorder eight pieces kids apron kids cooking aprons adjustable children chef apron. It's $25.99. Would you like to add it to your cart? No. Alex okay. Alexa, how long do I bake my ham? It is recommended to bake ham in the oven for 20 minutes per pound at 350 degrees Fahrenheit until it reaches an internal temperature of at least 145 degrees Fahrenheit. So it's 20. Start with meat at refrigerated temperature. Remove the meat from the oven when it reaches... Alexa, five stop. I know how to cook ham. I just didn't know. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Come on. So, I'm going to sit with her till about three-ish. 
and then go downstairs and start working and then I'm gonna work from 3 to 6 but um, actually I probably stop at 5 I work from 3 to 5 um, I'll see how, how big my ham is it doesn't take much just to throw it in the oven so I'll just put it in the oven what's that noise? is that your phone? is your phone turning on? I think I'm waiting for something. Am I waiting for something? I did order her some new dresses today. <laughs> yes. I went to Children's Place. They were having a sale, of course. And plus she needed um, some new dresses. She still wears size 4. Size 4 T. Um, but it's like... <sighs> Walmart 4Ts are, like, the leggings are just way too big for her. Um, they're too long and too wide. So, I mean, longness, them being long, I can deal with because they're leggings and you can just kind of, like, scooch them up if you know what I'm saying. If you know, if you feel me. Why does it sound like there's a truck out here? Anyway, um. Hold on, baby. Is there someone out here? Here, sit in that chair for a minute. Let me, let me open these. I don't know why. I like to have them open during the day anyway. No, there is not. I just thought I had something. Anyway, so, um, the, the ones she has on right now are size 40 and they came from Walmart, but I think it just depends on it's like they're all not the same you know what I mean them so I just bought her some pink ones some lavender ones and there was another pair do you remember oh they were um like an off uh-huh they were like an off hot pink they're like a weird like a fall more of a, you know, a fall tone pink, if that makes sense. And they all are too big. Well, she already ran the, the hot pink ones. <laughs> and so they got all stained up and dirty. So um, and I just ended up throwing those ones away. She wore them once to Tennessee. And they're just, I just don't like to put her, I mean, I, she's going to get dirty. She's like by far. The messiest child I've ever had like none of her clothes like the moment she puts them on they're like instant messed up talking about you Jern I love you so I ordered her some clothes from children's place now children's place clothing the four T's fit good with the size 4 because they go up to 5T and then they go size 4, size 5, 6, you know, that's how their sizing goes. The size 4, just regular 4, not toddler, just 4. Those fit pretty good and the 5Ts fit pretty good. So, that's in children's place. And... <clears throat> Carter's I think I'd move her up to a 5T because Carter's kind of runs small smaller smallish I should say so the 5T would be give her like growing room so it all just depends on the, the stuff I'd say she's between a 4 and a 5 but everything like all the like the Halloween pajamas I bought last year fit her perfect, size 40. Um, she had on a Halloween shirt earlier and some leggings. Um, in fact, the leggings kept falling down because they're too loose. And I'm like, you wore these last year. I don't know. So, But she could still fit all that stuff. So anyway, my house is a mess. 
someone come and clean it. I could be cleaning it during these next 15 minutes, but instead, I'm gonna watch little YouTube. I don't have a whole bunch on my list to make today. In fact, I think there's like seven. So. Okay, we just filmed this and we keep having a memory card error. We're making brownies. We filmed a whole episode. Episode. A whole, probably, I don't know, five, six minute clip. So, we're going to see if this works. So, we are making brownies, right? Yes. I am. I know, but it was getting too hard. Now we gotta put it all in this. Mom, can I pour it? Oh, I gotta get the chocolate. Scraper. The chocolate all out. Gotta get the chocolate scraper. Do you think Papa likes brownies? Yeah. You think Uncle Brian likes brownies? Yeah. It's too hard, baby. Mama's gonna have to do it. Ugh. I used this. You did a great job. Oops. All right, cutie, cutie. Where is the thing to stop So here are the beans. How those are. We got our ham, our green beans, cornbread, some olives for the girls, and some mashed potatoes. For some. Yeah, let's 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 vlog it now. Tell me. I said hot dog and beans was good. Was it really good? Yes, it was good. Should With I, that cornbread. Should I make them again? Not, to, not tonight. <laughs> no, no. We'll talk about it for the next few days. But right. if you'd make them again, I sure would appreciate it. Because they was good. <laughs> these little boobs.
Do you see that statue? Oh, yeah. There's a dog sitting there. There's a dog still. This is a statue. Don't you like it? She's going to be like that. You need some silver bag to be like that. Hi, guys. So, I don't know if I'm going to work. I honestly just do not feel like working. I'm just, I don't know. It's, I go through like spurts. I think what I'm gonna do is clean. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Although I have my heat press heating up. I think I just might clean. Um, it needs it. And I put away these blanks. I don't know yet. I just, I feel really, I think, um, I think it's just because I'm worried. <laughs> I have worry about the hurricane and, you know, Danny's down there and she lost power probably. It was like around six. Um, she called and said that they had just lost power and that cell service was intermittent, you know. So, anyway, um, I just, it's horrible. I saw, you know, just stuff on the news. We don't, um, we don't tend to watch news. Number one, we don't have like cable or anything like that. We just have, um, the Roku, but we can get some, you know, news channels on that, on the Roku, but we did watch that during dinner. It's like, <sighs> and my husband, I was like, I think, I think I just cooked so much food because I was nervous. I was like, it's like, um, yeah, because it's like Thanksgiving or something. <laughs> like, you know, kind of keeps my mind off stuff. Uh, I know she'll be okay. I know she will. Right? Right. It's just, I feel bad for like, not only like Jacqueline and her island that she lives on because, you know, so much damage is done. But like, just looking at the path. Not just in Florida, but the whole, you know, um, all the other places got hit by the hurricane. It's just, it's just so sad. Um, I saw one video and it was like, there's a fly in here. It was like somebody's, it was a, I have no idea because I'm not into sports car. It was some expensive sports car and it was just like floating down in some water. I was like, dang. I'm like... It. Get out of here, fly. We're not friends no more. What was I saying? Oh, yeah. I'm like, you would think that... I don't know. You would think you would evacuate. I'm just saying. I'm not saying... What am I saying? The people who are, like, there, that they knew that they were going to get hit, like, right there on the coast. Um, but, you know... I think if it was us and we lived there, I'd be like, um, let's go. <laughs> I know some people can't, can't, can't travel. Some people can't, don't have a car. Some people, you know, don't have the money. Some people just, you know, and I think that's, you know, what, um, you know, really sad for people that you know couldn't get out of it like if even if they wanted to they, they that stupid fly even if they wanted to they couldn't you know what I mean? anyway let me I'm gonna start with cleaning off this table and and I'm just really tired <laughs> I think what I'll do is I'll just it's 844 right now I did get an AJ Blanks order. Um, I think I'll put this away. I think I'll clean up. 
um, if I don't work, there is technically, I think there was three. I thought there was seven, but I think there's three. Um, the other ones that I put on my list that I was going to make today aren't due to ship out, but I was going to make them because it was like the same item and I just got a rush order too. So let's see here. Um, dum -dum -dum. Okay, I have too many. Um, a Halloween shirt and two of the same design, which is the candy. And then that was the only, the only ones. And then, um, and two days, two days is that. I mean, I have a person with five and a person with three. And then, yeah, I should be. Then after that, everything else is, I mean, it was slow, like two weeks ago. It was slow, so. Um, there's just those three, which I can add on tomorrow and make them tomorrow and ship them. I think I might do that. I just, I don't know. That and TMI is that time of month. <laughs> it's like, I just feel drained. Um, so I'm going to clean up here and then I don't know what. So I cleaned up, packaged up one order. Oh, I got a schedule pick up. And that's it. It is 10 o'clock. I'm going to bed. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Bye, guys.